Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 10 of Let's Play Ratchet and Clank Future or Kraken Time. Alright, we are in Krell Canyon and gotta find this obsidian eye. And let me try out this new plasma striker. Okay, so you gotta use L1, of course, to aim. Uh, press R3 to zoom in really fast. Or zoom in really far. It didn't die. Still didn't die. Still didn't die. Maybe that thing cannot be destroyed. Perhaps it's not even an enemy. Snoop around, Chief. Hey, whack and it does nothing either. I mean, whack the enemy. Or whack the plant, not whack. Never mind, guys. You know what I'm talking about. We have to find a way to raise that mining platform. Luckily, I come prepared. Alright. There. Head to the bottom. See if you can raise the platform. I'll cover you from here. I wish the camera angles were a little bit better. It keeps going down. Why is it constantly going down like this? Thought I was supposed to swing shot over there, but I guess not. Your father and I used to come here all the time when we were children. Back when this was a rarity of mine. Looks all dried up now, but believe me, this whole place used to shimmer. We'd sneak in after the Vollards left and just puff a boot through the darkness. <laughs> Caden almost broke his arm right over there. We had some good times out here. Well, I didn't even need to know that much detail, but thanks. I remember Raritanium being a thing in the third game. Well, let me try that again. Bounce off that plant. And you can grab onto those pipes. I suppose that's one way to get back up if you need to. Look, I did the thing. Now I need to go back down again. Alright, so I can use those blue plants to go back up, which is nice. I suppose this is what I need to do to advance. I did see a gold bolt over there, too. How the hell I'm gonna reach it? Nice job, Ratchet! I knew you could do it! Come on, get back up here and let's find that eye! You can go on, I can take good care of myself. <laughs> I don't know about you, but uh... Yeah, just leave it to me. <laughs> then again, I know how paranoid you can get. <laughs> you tried to kill me earlier. I still want to look for all those, uh, camel crates, wherever they are. That's a hydro plant. Looks safe enough to spring you back to the surface. Try jumping on it. Clearly you didn't watch me do that before, uh, Azimuth. I already had that under control. Jump onto the ledge to grab on. <laughs> it's giving me to the tutorial when I have to do it, and not when I didn't have to, and yet still knew how to do it early. You did well. Come on, let's search the caves. Right, how the hell am I gonna reach that? It looks really far. Is it possible? Right now, I don't know. If I just. Oh yeah, you can reach it. Nice. Just have to like hang on to the wall. I wonder how much I need for the next skin anyway. I can go with Mustachio Furioso. Oh, yeah, it actually gives me the mustache. Look at that. I look so dapper. There. 
I was able to make it back without having to climb back up again. That saves us a little bit of time. Also, there's another bolt over there. How the hell do I reach this one? Looks like I gotta get it through a grating. Hold up. See that nest over there? Tetramites. Stay close, and whatever happens, do not let them touch you. What happens if they do? Let's just say they can digest anything. Now remember, tetramites hate water. If we can get to the other side of that creek, we'll be fine. Let's move. Yeah, they don't seem to like water because they just backed away as soon as I got over there. Okay, now I believe there is a skill point you can get. And believe it or not, the way to get the skill point is get bit by every tetramite den without dying. Of course, that's easier said than done, given, like, obviously how much health you lose when you get eat, hit by one. I recognize all of this. There's a rock ledge down there. We used to hover blue. What the? My jump did not register? Are you kidding me? I tap jump twice. Well, so much for that idea. I guess if you let it have a tiny nipple, it'll be fine. Come on, we're almost through. Because then it's just like one bite. I recognize all of this. There's a rock ledge down there we used to hover boot off of. Straight Why up. is it not registering the jump? The is it because those tetramites are biting me? Because I do seem to move slower when they're biting. And therefore, it also affects my jump. You're reminding me more of your father every minute. Come on, we're almost through. Yeah, they do affect it. I recognize all of this. There's a rock ledge down there. We used to hover. Yeah, you see, I can actually uh, jump over there. I was scared the first time, but your father, he didn't blink. Feels like yesterday. General, can we talk about what happened with my father, the Lombaxes? Now is not the time for destructions. Not when we're this close. Oh, look who's talking. Okay, it looks like I have to keep pulling them. Oh, I can turn it sideways, too. That's helpful. There we go. Oh, shoot. I just got wiped. I think I took too long. That's why. Well, that sucked. Let's try that again. reminding me more of your father every minute. Come on. We're almost through. I recognize all of this. There's a rock ledge whoa, down there. Whoa, 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 okay. Of, straight into nothingness. <laughs> I was scared the first time. But your father, he didn't blink. Feels like yesterday. General, can we talk about what happened with my father, the Lombaxes? Now is not the time for destructions. Not when we're this close. Talk about a total hypocrite. <laughs> Just, oh! How the hell do I steer past that part? Because by the time I get to that ledge, Tetramites are already there. You're reminding me more of your father every day. Alright, bite me. Come on, we're almost through. How many hives are there? I recognize all of this. There's a rock ledge down there we used to hover boot off of. Straight into nothingness. <laughs> I was scared the first time, but your father, he didn't blink. Feels like this. General, can we talk about what happened with my father, the Lombaxes? Now is not the time for destructions. Not when we're this close. Okay, let's think about this for a second. How the hell do I get over there in time? Oh, shoot, I made it. 
But look how close I am to death. They can't climb up here. You're doing great, Ratchet. Keep going and don't look down. Why not? Oh. Oh, thank God I grabbed that. Oh, thank God I grabbed that. Easy, Ratchet. Easy. You're almost there. Is that the last hive? What did I tell you? A leap of faith. General, wait! Oh, okay. Don't just whack that willy nilly. Where'd the other hive go? Oh, wait. This still, still counts as my third bite. <laughs> Did that cancel because I just went back? Or it triggered the cutscene? That might be what it was. Alright, whatever you say. Wait, what the hell am I supposed to do now? Do I just fall? Well, I guess I'm just falling. Oh, okay. General, will you just stop for a second? I want to know what happened. <laughs> questions, questions. You ask all these questions. Ask yourself this. How relevant is the past when it can be changed? Your father would have said not very. That's him. And you still haven't given me a straight answer. Now why aren't you with the Lombaxes? Because I failed them! After the Great War, Polaris was a dangerous place. Even with the Kragmites gone, I knew steps needed to be taken to protect the galaxy. One day, we were approached by an inventor with incredible ideas, technology light years beyond what we were using. The inventor was someone... someone your father warned me not to trust. Our kind had grown suspicious of him, but I was convinced this was the right thing to do. For the galaxy, I granted him full access to our technology, all of our secrets, only when he was finished. They took refuge in the court, but your father refused. He would never have left your mother, but when he made it back, she... she was already gone. I don't know how long he survived before Tachyon caught up with him, but I know I was responsible for his death. For my crimes? I was forbidden from joining the Lombaxes, and so, I live in exile. I can make it right, Ratchet. All of it. I... We can fix it. With the clock under our control, it'll be like none of this ever happened. Stay with me, and I promise, I'll get your family back. <laughs> I have a feeling this will come into conflict with uh, reuniting with Clank later because he was instructed not to use the Great Clock as something to change time. And of course, this is what Azimuth wants to do. The Agorians have launched a full-scale assault on the settlement. Our kind has barricaded themselves in their homes. We have no time for petty squabbles. Ratchet, remember the mission. The Obsidian Eye is all that matters. The Eye? It's in a temple. I can take you there. Please, we are not an aggressive race. Help us defeat the Agorians and I'll show you where it is. I guess we have no choice. We can't use that bridge. Destroy the Agorian Riders. Alright. Let me, uh... Get this uh, plasma striker ready. Gotta find the weak spot. Find it. Is it on the head? Oh, somewhere where it blinks green.
Man, that cost me a lot of my ammo. But wait till this thing gets beefed up. Then it's over for all these, uh, bisnitches. Alright, where's the next one? Is it over there? It looks to be maybe above. Yeah, I don't have an immediate shot on it, so I guess I'm gonna have to find something else. I'm guessing those were supposed to be gun turrets, but they're not online. And of course, can't buy any new armor yet. Well, so much for just picking them off. I'm gonna have to, like, use some combat from up close. Alright, let me get the bombs ready. So there's five riders, and I got one of them killed. There's the next one. This guy clearly got some backup. It's two. Alright, three more to go. Who's that in green anyways? That Azimuth? Alright, where are the other three? Maybe I gotta go across this ledge. Whee! You you know that. Well, Agorians are not really known for their uh, beauty. They're known for their violence. If I can say that, because that's the first time I even heard of the Agorians. Avoid breaking mist tanks. Red mist makes Agorians go berserk. Well, I guess bombs are not necessarily the uh, best weapons to use, then. The bombs are level 4. Oh, and I'm just now getting the upgrade. Funny, they said there was that V4 for a while, and then it let me know what I got. This one's mine. Is it now? Thanks, much appreciated. It says like there's a rider nearby, but I don't see it. I don't think he's mean there's ships. Wait, is that it up there? No. It says it's around here. But I see nothing. Do I have to kill all these other ones first? Oh no, there it is, right here. Right, come back over here, you need to die. Gotcha. And there's three down. I haven't even found any extra camel crates nearby either. All right, we're looking for you. Hope we can get some new ammo for the plasma striker again. Oh yeah, I actually have enough. Never mind. I need to get more kills for this thing anyway, so I'll just pick off anyone. Once I get this thing leveled up, it's going to be a nightmare for anybody that gets in its way. Just like in, uh, up your arsenal. Welcome back. I definitely loved using the sniper rifle then, too. What 
the hell do I need you for? Where are you supposed to go? Over here? Yes! Okay. All that for a mod. Okay, well, that's a thought that counts. It's for the pistol. Rapid fire? Sign me up! Is it because it's rapid fire that my ammo capacity is now at 75? Or was it always at 75? No, it seems I only just got there now. Okay, that, that works for me. I guess they'd have to because it's rapid fire. Oops. Hi. Okay, these are red dots. Level up. Okay, there was a bit of a delay on that one. Damage and ammo capacity have gone. Fantastic. Beautiful. Took out their ship. That should make things a lot difficult for them now. Alright. Man, we're gonna get a lot of bolts for this, too. Hey! Where'd you come from? You weren't supposed to stay alive. Zircon the Destroyer, and it got like a new paint job. Oh, baby. Now we're uh, talking. Now we got some raw firepower. my grill. I don't like that. You'll have no choice but to remember, Mr. Zarkov. Yay, nanotech went off. Oh, Jesus. There, the riders are gone. Outsiders, we've got fiber tanks moving in over the ranch. We're gonna need some heavier firepower. Wait here, I'll cover you from the sky. Hunt down the Hydra tanks next? All right, Chief. Oh, thanks for filling up my ammo. But man, it's always something. Plasma Striker is still going to be, like, my best weapon, though. If it... If I find the tank, at least. Let me use the gun until I find the tank. I think I'm going away from it, though. Unless... That's it right here. <laughs> oh, wait, there's the tank! Mr. 
I don't know if it can pick us off from here, though. I see some of its weak spots. Problem is, it keeps moving. Oh, it can pick us off from there. Oh, that's what I have to do. I thought I could just use the gun. So I guess I gotta do that for each side. So once I do some damage, I can probably rip off another one. get too close. We gotta beat it up a little bit more. I don't know what more I have to do to it. So I was able to rip off one thanks to the plasma stroke. Oh, I'm out of bombs. So as long as I keep dodging, I should be okay. Oh, there's another one. It seems to be exposed whenever he puts up his shield. One more. Boom, that's one tank. Will do. Let me get some health first. I can find it. Uh, is that it right there? Yep, there it is. Get some ammo too. Plasma Striker definitely uh, serves its purpose for clearing out the weak spot. Of course, I can't do much more than that. Gotta <laughs> keep the change? What? No, I don't want him to keep the change. I need the change. I need to buy new weapons and armor later. That change goes to us. Oh, there's some camel points. Yes, I know there's one more Hydra tank. I need to find where it is. It's gotta be over this way. Alright, that was weird. Let's try that again. Hydra tank. Hydra tank. Oh, 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 sh oh shit, there it is. Okay, so it looks like whenever that health bar turns blue, it's going to be exposed. And then when it's red, I got to start shooting it again. That's the vibe I'm getting from this. Tanks are actually not that hard to fight. They only have, what, a couple attacks, and they're pretty easy to dodge. And the rest of it is just, like, remembering to pull this off. Literally. More than just figuratively. Got it. We're getting more backup. That's it. 
Adios, bitches. Okay, so I can see where my gun would overheat. And I have a set amount of missiles, too. So I can't just fire them willy-nilly. Oh, but at least I can target multiple ships. I have 40 of these to destroy? Not making it easy for me, game. Oh god, they're gonna fire some bombs? Oh, oh I almost shot at my, uh, the other Lombax. There's a lot of now they're coming at us. Okay. Still got plenty of health though. Oh god. I was got hit by those bombs. You don't really get a lot of turning on this. Last of them. Even though there were still more. Good work, Ratchet. We did it. I'm setting it down. You did it, outsiders. You stopped the invasion. It's time for me to live up to my side of the bargain. Come on back and I'll show you where the temple is. You dare to hurt measly furball. Okay, we did it. So now we can just go to the temple and find that obsidian eye. Good day, kind sir. Do you require armor? Oh, I wish. What the hell? How did that push me back so far? Well, that was dumb. All right, now I gotta do that again. I gotta do all five to ten seconds of this. How dare you, game? All I wanted to do was get a drop on some boxes. Is that too much to ask? Happy to be of service. However, there is the matter of guiding us to the obsidian eye. Yes, of course. Naturally, I can. Or how long is this cave? Eh, it seems a bit lengthy. What do you got for us? We closed these caves off years ago. Too many dangers, too many deaths. Perhaps that Omni Soaker will ward off the Tetramites. You two all right in there? Looks like the door rusted right off its track. I'll try to get it fixed, but then uh, it might be a while. Try breathing real shallow like. Well, looks like the only way out is in. What do you think? Should we give that Omni Soaker a try? Good. Now, see if you can use it to fatten up that hydro plant. You just saw me do it. Had to give it more. You have to admire bullet engineering. <coughs> that Omni Soaker can suck up almost anything. Water, nectar, 
<laughs> Even oil. Hmm. I'll have to keep that in mind. Anyway, I'm going to stop here, and in the next episode, we'll get through these caves. See everyone. Thanks for watching.